Can I do the introduction please? Yes, sure, go ahead. So, hello everyone. Welcome back to Arsika Verse. So, this is my sister's channel and and I have joined as a guest. So, Athav, do you know what we are going to do in this video? Yes, we are going to talk about these awesome graphic novels. And that too for 6 to 8 year olds. So, without much further ado, let's begin. So, Athar, why do you like uh, graphic novels? I like graphic novels because they are funny and they have cool illustrations. Yes, I guess that uh, sums it all up. So, if you are a kid reading it, then like my brother said, they are very funny and just hilarious. And you'll also enjoy the cool illustrations. If you are a non-reader, then graphic novels are the best way to start. Here is an example. My brother was a non-reader and now he just gobbles up books. Okay, and if you are a mature reader, then also you can read these books as, you know, they can act as a break from complex chaptered books. So, which book should we recommend first, Ethel? So, we should recommend my favorite book called Dogman. Okay, so Ethel, why do you like Dogman? I like Dogman because it's about a dog-headed cop who goes and saves the world from this evil cat called Petey. Now Petey comes up with a lot of ideas to save the world. I mean to destroy the world. <laughs> okay. So uh, basically this Dogman is by Dave Pickley and it's about a dog who is a man or a man who is a dog whichever way you want to put it and he fights for justice in town and like my brother said he fights with the uh, evil cat pt and uh, this book is filled with action suspense and mystery it is also very funny and just so hilarious that it's impossible to not laugh okay and uh, we both loved reading this book and i uh, highly recommend it so, which should be the next book, Atha? So, the next book should be Captain Underpants. So, what is Captain Underpants all about? So, Captain Underpants is about a guy who flies around in his underwear. Okay, that's uh, so funny. Just imagine a guy flying around in his underwear fighting crime with his two companions, George and Harold. The idea will just... Oh, you know, make you roll on the ground laughing. So it was a really good book and I enjoyed reading it. Actually, we both enjoyed reading it. It was filled with action and laughs. And oh, Captain Underpants fought with, you know, different characters. And oh, it was very funny. I guess Dave Pickley did a great job writing it because I think it will be adored by children and oh, children will love reading it like my brother did. It also has a lot of flipperamas and oh, I it makes the book more interesting. I hope you enjoy reading it. That was Captain Underpants. Highly recommended. So, which should be the next book? So, next book should be Tom Gates. Okay, so what's in this book? So, so in this book, the, it is about a boy with his classmates. And in the first book, it's about Tom Gates finding missing stuff and he has to deal with this very strict supply teacher. Okay, so uh, this is Tom Gates and it has a lot of books in the series. I've got two of them and the rest I've read on my Kindle. So this book is about Tom Gates, his classmates and his family. Uh, this book is is very funny because it's so heavily illustrated i don't think it's illustrated it should be called doodles okay and oh, which makes it very funny and oh i'll sing this one more time very 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 funny Bonk. and uh, children will adore this book uh, we both also enjoyed reading it and i really think it's a good book and oh, what else can I say? It's so amazing.
Um, Asuka, I think you should tell the next book. Okay, I think it should be Diary of a Wimpy Kid and Awesome Friendly Kid together. I mean, Diary of an Awesome Friendly Kid. Okay, so uh, they both are written by the same author. And this is about Greg Heffley. And this one is about Rowley Jefferson, who are both best friends. So I think uh, because they're linked like this together, I thought of reviewing them together. So they both set out to write diaries. Um, Asuka, I think it's a journal. Yes, I stand corrected. Greg Heffley is very particular about calling it a journal and not a diary. And my brother is too. Okay, so this book is uh, very funny and interesting. You can read about their lives and how it is. I think oh, this is for a little older kids, like 7 to 8 year old, but you'll thoroughly enjoy it. So that was the idea of a wimpy kid. So I think think that's all the books that we have for now. Oh wait, there's also Amulet. Oh yes, I completely forgot about it. So this book, unlike the other ones which are funny, is mysterious, magical and adventurous. And spooky, that too. Okay, so this book is about Emily and her brother Naveen. So I've already reviewed this book once before, so I'm not going to talk much about it. You can watch my other videos and I'll post the link in the description. So this book is mysterious. Hey, I've already said that before. Okay, so this book is filled with cool illustrations like these. And it's really nice. If you just start reading it, you'll be hooked and it's unputdownable. It's very good and what else can I say? You just have to read it. So I guess that's all the books that we have. Right, Atho? Yes. Okay. So we have come to the end of the video. I hope you read some of the books and I hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you in another book recommendation or review. This is Arshika and Atho signing off. One, two, three, peace. Yes, the video was very nice. Yeah, I think we nailed it. <laughs> okay, so it's done. Yeah.